Alright, let's open this thing up. And see what we got here. Alright. Okay, yes. It is in peanuts. I do not like peanuts, but... Like I said, peanuts work. So in this particular case, we must have peanuts. Now, peanuts can often be found alongside corn. Plus the presence of any fiber substance of which spinach is a big one. All right. Looks like we're going to get four blue boxes. Here we go. Here's some stuff. Oh, okay. Spinach is nice. And we're gonna save this. Oh, these are, these are good peanuts. These are nice peanuts right here. Okay. So we're gonna save them peanuts. Alright, let's check it out. Let me see what's in here. Now, if I had to guess, I'm gonna say. These three are SD40 2s, and this one is an F7. So let's start with, let's take a look at the F7. Ah, there we go. Oh, yeah, all right. Oh, it's even got the bone. And some detail parts. It's got, we well, got one coupler. I'm pretty sure we can find another coupler. Ah, yes. Okay. This is old school. It's metal side frame. It does not feel like a super to me. So I'm pretty sure this is just a regular. The super, the super has this massive weight that sits in it. So that guy. Okay, so then we'll set that box. Over here. And we've got. side frames. Pretty nice. Alright. Let's set that guy over here. Oh yeah, there we go. There is the original construction diagram. Very nice. I remember when these were released. And they're a big deal because they are just they're just a little bit they were a little bit of an upgrade to like the SD forty five and the SD two forty. They had a scale with hood, removable dynamic brakes. Um, and this one looks like it's like really clean. Same one. Okay. We'll get into them. Just want to see what we had in here. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to get this guy running first. We'll take him all the way down. And then we're going to get him all the way back up again. And that will be, that will be our first project. Then we'll go ahead and get those SD40s. We're going to break them down, clean everything, rewire it, and set it up again. And then we'll be doing the coders. But one of the things that's going to be going in there is a Tsunami 2. So that that should be kind of fun. It's, I've never tried one of these, so going to be it looks like it's going to be really cool it's got a lot of neat stuff on it well, we'll find out all right 
let's get the show on the road.